Nothing. Hello guys, and welcome back to some more Smiler content. You guys have been asking for it, so here you go. Here is some Smiler content. So, this is the most biggest news yet so far. We have this page. Now, this page is telling us the Smiler could still reopen at all towers after crash if it meets health and safety requirements. And... Here it says, the boss of Walton Towers have said the Smiler Road Coaster will only reopen if all necessary safety checks have been made. Nikki Varney, Chief Executive of Merlin Entertainment, made a statement after one of the victims of the devastated crash revealed details of meeting between the pair. Vicky Belch, who had a leg amputated, results in a collision between two carriages and said, We've already read all of this. But, if it meets the regulations, we could see it opening. Probably for the Scarefest. Now, this is all just news. News can be wrong. As we all know, we had a news from ages ago saying the Smiler will reopen for Halloween and etc. And we've had other things like that happen in the past. Constantly. Really constantly. All this just keeps happening and it just goes mental. Should I bump my hair today? My hair just seems to not, just not want to go over there. Yeah. But as you can see, guys, that... That is the latest news we have so far with Smiler. So you guys really love the Smiler. I have to admit, guys, thank you so much for supporting my other channel, this channel here so far. Uh, we've I've started doing Smiler content. No one seems to have uh, deceived me. Everyone seems to keep watching these Smiler content. So I just keep posting them because they are, well, exciting for people, I guess. Now, if, I guess people really want to know what's going on. And I do go, I do go into detail a little bit on the Smiler. Now, in terms of it opening, it's a 50-50. At the moment, no one can really call it. Because we've had this, haven't we? We've had this, losing too much money, we've already read this, etc, etc. Smiley could reopen because we're losing too much venue. There's all that sort of stuff going on at the moment. And then we had this on the 8th of September, never reopening. It's just the news just keep playing with us that I really don't know anymore. What? What? What is the answer? This is the question. What is the answer? We have another news break. The Smiler could still reopen after the crash. We, we, we can see that. But, we click on it again, actually. Let's read down a bit. I was asked about this, and I was very open and made no compliment about impact on our business as the cashless responsibility. Ah, so they've they've told they've apologised to Vicky as well, which I guess is a good thing. I mean, the brother, his brother, his brother, her brother last week was like, oh, "I'm gonna go and tear it down myself, hand by hand," you know. But um, that that that's not gonna happen in a million years. You'd have to get past security to do that. But like I said, guys, the Smiler is a 50/50. It's really 50/50 now. I can't. No one's gonna call this. I mean, if you want to count the days down to the Scarefest. 17th so there are only 15 days till the scare fest it's uh honestly no clue what is going to happen we have no clue whatsoever all i know is what is going to happen anyway guys this was a very short video i just wanted to clear something up about that thank you so much for watching if you did enjoy this video never give a big thumbs up also guys could we please hit 10 likes remember to subscribe guys top right corner top left corner and Thanks for watching. Peace out, guys, and I'll see you all later.